when you got uh, all the armies marching, that's how the nukes gonna be taking off. All right. Like it's gonna be like an army setting them ready, man. So read that part again, huh? Right, cut, read. A day of clouds and of thick darkness, right. as the morning spread upon the mountains, right. a great people and the strong. There have not been ever the light, neither shall be any more after it. Right, it says what? There shall be, meaning before these nukes was created, it was nothing like these bombs. And after these nukes is dropped, it ain't gonna be no more of these men. Because these are the Lord's weapon. Give me Isaiah 54 and 16. Because the Lord put the spirit on these devils to create these nuclear missiles, man. To take that, to take out their own kingdom. Right. Right. To take out, that's why he said what? Before these missiles was made, it was none like it. And after they drop, it's gonna be none like it. Read what you got? 54 and 16. Isaiah chapter 54, verse 16. Right? Behold, I have created the smith. The Lord said, I had created the what? The smith. The smith. Now, when you deal with smith, that's a person that deals with what? Metals. You right. know what I'm saying? That's a person that deals with, like, your swords. He meant, like, today, you got what? A locksmith. Right. Now, I mean, he unlocked your car. Or you got a gun that called what? Smith and Wesson. Because uh, that, that's a person who makes, uh, who makes weapons. You know what I'm saying? Now, everybody don't got the brains to make a, a nuclear weapon. And not everybody had the guts to make a nuclear weapon. Because one wrong thing go wrong in that fucking laboratory. Yo ass out of it. Yo ass out of it. So the Lord said, I had created the Smith. I put the spirit on these devils to fuck with the elements to create something that's so destructive. You know what I'm saying? Right. So read it again. Right. Behold, I have slot. It's Isaiah chapter 54, verse 16. Cut. Behold, I have created the smith. Yeah, I have created the smith, read. That bloweth the coals in the fire. That bloweth the coals in the fire, read. And that bringeth forth the instrument for his work. That brings forth an instrument for his work. What's that instrument? The nuclear missiles. What's the work? Downtown North, Sin City, Las Vegas, South Beach, Miami. These are the works that the devil have built up. He bringing forth an instrument for his work, read. And I have created the waster to destroy. He had created the what? The waster to destroy. He had created the waster to destroy, man. So the Lord put the spirit on these smiths, man. Give me um, have a cool four verse uh four, four verse five. Habakkuk, yeah, 4 verse 5. It's Habakkuk, chapter 4 verse 5. Uh, 2 verse 5. It's Habakkuk, chapter 2 verse 5. Right. Yea, also, because he transgresseth by one. The white man transgressed by one. All our people is in the fucking matrix, man. What, you believe in this world, you live, you believe it, and you follow it, and you live in a lie, man. Read on. He is a proud man. The white man is a what? He is a proud man. His crackers is proud. They gonna fight the Lord with the angels when he come back. And the Lord is coming back in an angelic form. So for you to say, man, fuck that, we about to fight it out then. You got high levels of pride, man. Right, God. He's a, and you know what helped give a white man his pride, these crackers, they pride? Because what helped give them their pride is their technology. Just like a nigga when he get an automatic weapon. He go from a five shot 38 to a Mac 10. He get pride, he think he the man. And, and that's what these crackers' weapons do to our people. It gives you a false sense of power, man. Until he gets shot down and laid out with a 25. You know what I'm saying? Because what? The, these crack, these carnal weapons give these devils a false sense of power. You know what I'm saying? And it powers you in a negative way, man. And I actually see a nigga get his hands on a weapon and he act like he's all tough and all bad and shit, man. Because that's what the white man's weapons do, because they carnal, man. Right? It gives you a false sense of power. You guys understand? It's Obadiah, verse 3. The pride of thine heart hath deceived thee. Thou that dwellest in the cleft of the rocks. Right, thou that dwell in the cleft of the rocks. 
fleshly, whose habitation is high. Right, and so the Lord said what? That pride of the heart have deceived me. Because these white men, the, these devils, they trust in their technology. So they feel as though what? Even when the Lord make his second return, we gonna take him the fuck out. We got late, we got this, we got that. You know what I'm saying? Just like a nigga get his hands on a AK-47 or a 50 round Mac. You know what I'm saying? He like, yeah, I can take on anybody. You know what I'm saying? Because these weapons give you a false sense of power. But the Lord said what? Your technology has to see me, man. That saying in his heart, who shall bring me down to the ground? Right, that say in their heart, who shall bring me down to the ground? And that's how these devils feel. They feel as though what? No one can take them out of power. Mm -hmm. And really, through the spirit, no one can take them out of power. Because the Lord raised these crackers up so he could take them out of power. Right. He gave them the technology. So the, the Lord is basically feeding a bully to get all this weight on him. So the motherfucker looking like Debo, and he come and knock his ass smooth the fuck out. So all the earth can look in fear on the Lord. That's what right. That's the question. Huh? Uh, that's a brother in the spirit, and he's, and he's choking up the Edomite man, which is our enemy. Because the Bible talks about how the Lord's people is going to get revenge on their enemies for what they did to us as slavery. White people? Not just white people, Chinese people, Arabic people, East Indian people, Africans. That's right. They all the enemies of the Israelites when you read the Bible. This no, this no religion. This is the truth of the Bible as it is written. As you see, when we come up here, all we do is read scriptures. We not forced to no, 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 uh, no holidays, no nothing. Matter of fact, we we are uh, in the feast of uh, Pentecost, which is the first fruits. You know what I'm saying? So the Lord told us to be holy days. You know. Well, I, I, we the prophets of the Lord. Before the Lord destroyed any society, he he he, he, he sent he sent for water to give the people water. You know. Okay. This is uh, Jeremiah chapter 28 and 8. Right. The prophets that have been before me. Like the prophets that have been before me, read. And before thee of old prophesied both against many countries. Right. These prophets spoke against many countries, read. And against great kingdoms. And against great kingdoms. So a true man of the Lord ain't going to say, God bless America. Right. Any, any time a man of the Lord came on the scene, they came to condemn the place. Hope, hope, hope what you got. Give me 2 Samuel 16 and 4. The, the prophets came. When people saw the prophets, they was like, oh, shit. That's bad news. That's right. bad news. 16 and 4. This is 2 Samuel chapter 16, verse 4. Right. Then said the king to Zeba, behold, thy are all that pertain to
jump back to uh, the, uh, the nukes. Uh, Joel, Baba Kishan. Uh, oh, no, no. Jump back to uh, Abaku. I need to have a two and five. But still hold that jump up. So the Lord said he had what created the smith. He had created these devils. Hey, even these, these people that can make a nuclear weapon, these countries, they be stealing they're scientists, man. Right, like, uh, America stole Germany scientists under uh, Operation Paperclip, man. They be, they be, uh, say, if you knew how to make, this brother knew how to make a nuclear bomb. I guess, guess what? By, by tomorrow, your ass will be in Russia. Somebody will come and kidnap your ass, and tomorrow you'll be in Russia. That shows that these devils, man, they can't even trust themselves. Yeah. Like, these Edomites went and made nuclear weapons for America, atomic weapons for then they went, turned around, sold the secrets to Russia, turned around, gave to Germany. The dudes that was under the Oppenheimer project, a lot of them got assassinated, a lot of them got yeah. put to death in person. Because right. they went and traded on their nation and shit. Right. Right. That was a fucking devil. Right. 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 Hey, hey, we about to bring that out. We, uh, fin finish okay. that. Yeah, finish that. Have a cook, chapter 2, verse 5. Right. Oh, uh, no, no, no. 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 Of it, he said, What now I am become what? Death. Death. 
and the destroyer of worlds. Woo! Let's go! So read that again. Yeah. Who enlarges his desire as hell. These crackers enlarging their desire as hell. And what? And is as dead. And these devils is as not. what? Death. Death. Death, man. And that's one of his what? This one of his quotes he said. He said, I am become death and a destroyer of worlds. Because these new, the atom bomb went to the nuclear bomb. And, and when them shits drop, they're going to wipe worlds out, man. One question. <coughs> Who is his nationality? Now, Edomite. Oh, crackers. Crackers. Devil, man. Then you got flipping. You got Einstein. This is what he said. He was one of the forefathers. He said, look, I know not what weapons World War III will be for, which he do know. He was being sarcastic. Well, World War IV is not no World War IV, but World War IV will be fought with sticks and stones. That's right! Because what? These nuclear missiles is going to wipe everything out, That's man. Right. That's right. They're going to wipe everything out. And these two quotes of two devils that was two founding fathers of this weapon. Going back to the scripture, I have created the smith. That's right. And he that make the weapons, the Lord created these dudes, man. And the arms race back on. North Korea working on what? A nuclear program. Iran is working on what? A nuclear program. Donald Trump trying to speed things up. Because America ain't built a nuclear weapon since the 40s, man. He said, look, we got to upgrade our shit. You damn right. That show you the people here is in a docile and state of mind, man. That's right. You got countries ready to blow your ass to smithereens. And that's like a nigga running the streets. Like, nigga, you ain't wipe your gun off yet or bust it off to make sure it still works. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck is you doing, man? No career ready to take your ass out. Yeah. Which means, oh, we got to start upgrading our weapons. Nigga, you a little too late. That nigga but devil, man. You a little too late. You know, Jake calling like niggas, man. <laughs> but in the spiritual sense, that nigga spirit is going, even like how niggas behave, is, is affecting the other nations. You got Chinese people that act like niggas. You got crackers and devils that act like niggas, man. That nigga spirit has like spread it through, through everybody now, man. You, yeah, yeah. Like, against that thing, against the thuggish nigga spirit. Everybody acting like that now, man. They got like Africans, Indians acting like niggas, man. <laughs> Chapter 30, verse 7. Right. And Yahweh, thy power will put all these curses upon thine enemies. Right, because that was a curse for us to behave like that. Now what? The other nations is behaving like what? Niggas, man. Niggas, me. And on them that hate thee, which persecuted thee. Right, cut. That's it. Now jump back to Joel for me. Back to Joel, chapter, chapter 2. Verse 3. What, Khan? A fire devouring before them. Hold up. Bring it back a little bit. Khan. Uh, verse 2. A day of darkness and gloominess, a day of clouds and of thick darkness, Khan. as the morning spread upon the mountains, a great people right. and a strong. There have been, they have not ever, select. They, there have not been ever the light, neither shall be any more after it. Any more after it, read. Even to the years of many generations. And the kingdom, no more nuclear weapons, read. A fire devoured before them. The Lord said what? A fire devoured before them. The Lord said a fire burned before them. What the other side? Right, so a fire burned before them. Because really the power is in what? The warhead, right. read. And behind them a flame burning. And behind them, that's how you know it's not talking about the actual people. Right. It said what? And behind them a flame burning, free. The land is as the garden of Eden before, before the, them. Before the news drop, how was the garden of Eden? Everything was established. Everything looking nice. Sin City, Las Vegas. South Beach, Miami. Downtown Dallas. Downtown Los Angeles. Manhattan. The land is as what? The streets is paved. Light town, houses, the Prudential Center. Downtown 
downtown Jersey City. Lights, cameras, action. The land is as what? As the Garden of Eden before them. So before these dupes come, the land looked like the Garden of Eden, read. And behind them. So after they drop, what? A desolate wilderness. They gonna Ooh. empty this shit, man. That's right.